My teenage sister suffers from anxiety. Should I be concerned about substance abuse? There is definitely a direct link between anxiety and substance use. And our lab is actually the first in the world to highlight why that may be the case. Most substance use cases can originate from anxiety disorders actually. And we are working really hard to understand the biological processes that are involved in the wrong cognition that can occur in anxiety and addiction, hoping that we can tackle where the problem starts. It starts with our brain. And our work is very important because we are only one of a few in the world that actually examine these questions early in life, in children and adolescents. And historically, people have only looked at adults. And we think that's why we haven't had many breakthroughs in this field. We found out that memories developed early in life, especially ones that involve a lot of emotions, are very hard to forget. To deal with these problems, people often turn to drinking alcohol or other things that make them temporarily forget or feel better. But the problem is using these drugs can actually change your brain, creating it to be more anxious and it starts this vicious cycle. My work at the Flory has been groundbreaking because we are first to explain why if anxiety or substance use happens in adolescence or early in life, why that cycle is harder to break. It turned out that it's not that our teenagers are more anxious or more substance seeking. The emotional experiences they have early in their lives actually are very hard to forget. As an adult, you've had lots of similar experiences that can cushion the emotions that you go through as an adult. But as a teenager, many things are very brand new very first. So we are targeting this brain region to understand well what happens genetically, what happens at the molecular level. I was an anxious child. Um, I had many what we call unhealthy maladaptive thoughts and it's amazing. Um, we like to think that sometimes feelings come first and the brain comes next but oftentimes it's the other way. If we can actually change how we think we can change how we feel. So we are really studying those biological processes at the Flory and we believe that by looking at the origin of anxiety and addiction early in life we can prevent and treat these disorders. Every donation to the Flory is a step closer to finding the answer. Be part of the answer. Donate to the Flory today.